feel like your rise has just been steady and rapid over the last three years. Do you feel that way? Um, I feel like it has definitely been a journey. I don't feel like it was. It, it's been rapid, but I will say that uh, it's been moving in the right direction. So I'm, I'm super grateful. So now, I mean, you're headed in the right direction because you're headed on the stage with some legends. You're on the yeah. full circle tour. How do you feel about that? It's very full circle, to be honest. Um, I remember uh, being signed to a major label and the first person that I worked with was Babyface. And I was in the studio with him for two weeks. And um, yeah, it was a great experience. And so to actually now to open up and to share the stage with him in a, in a whole different capacity is truly full circle for me. I remember um, doing um, Kim's Mac and Third, which is a festival that he does in Detroit. And I did that a couple of years ago. So to actually now be on tour is, is a very surreal moment. So it's a very full circle experience for me as well. So a lot of cities to cover. So is there one in particular that you're looking forward to the most? I mean, Jackson, obviously. You know what I mean? That's where we, you know what I'm saying? That's that's where we coming. So we coming April 15th. You know what I'm saying? Be on the lookout for that. It's, it's going to be a vibe. It's going to be fun. That was a good answer, but no, yeah. for real. What's the real <laughs> thing you're looking forward to? <laughs> Honestly, I think, I think every city, every city, because I mean, a lot of people don't know who I am. They may know a song by me, but they may not necessarily know who I am and, and they've never seen me perform or engage with them. So this is a great opportunity for me to, to really connect with people and to, you know, I look at it like this, I'm a discovery artist. So every time someone sees me, I'm a blank canvas. So now, you know, they get to, you know, create this, these thoughts and these, you know, visions and images in their mind of what type of artist I am and what kind of service and music and energy that I can provide in the future. And that I'm really excited about, yeah. In a time where love songs are starting to, you know, go on away, why are you still choosing to sing about that today? Um, love will always prevail. You know what I mean? Love doesn't get old. And, and um, you know, I, I remember being in church one Sunday a couple of years ago and the pastor said, truth don't change with trend. And that stuck with me in a sense that love is always truth. You know what I mean? God is love. We are made of love, full of love. And, and we're willing to give it. We're willing to take it. And, um, you know, we have to, you know, continue to carry on with the message of love because people want that. People desire that. And whether or not it's today that they desire it, but, you know, my game plan is all set for tomorrow. My eyes are set on, you know, hey, you may not be feeling it today, you know what I'm saying? But down the road, you're going to want this music. So catalog is important. And I'm young enough to, uh, to endure and to grow with my audience too. So, you know, Shout out to the OGs and the vets. And, and for me, I want to create the same feelings that they created for their generation. You know what I mean? For, for ours, to make them feel appreciated, to make women feel appreciated, to make them feel loved, understood, seen, right? Um, and we just have to do it in our own way. So, you know, that's the mission. And uh, we're going we gonna to fulfill that for sure. When you first walk out on that stage, right? Yeah. What are you giving us? Are you giving us a good little, you know, Michael Jackson moment? Or are you going to be cool and calm? You know what? Um, let's just say this. I'm, I'm very engaging. You don't, you, you won't ever have to worry about where my mind is at and where my eyes are set. My eyes are always set on the audience. My, 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 my mind is always set on how can I engage them even more so from the start of the show even if I come out smooth and cool even if I give you a Michael Jackson moment, whatever the case may be um you know I, I'm I want to lock in with you and I want for the audience to lock in with me and so I think that's going to be the most important part is that you know we we're in for a good time